In this video, I am going to show you guys what I just purchased from my beloved friend, Taobao! Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video from Ling Ling. Today I'm filming from my own room. Yay! And you can see my table here in the back. <laughs> Lately I have been shopping a little bit on Taobao because I had no money for a while and I was like, meh, this is annoying. And then I finally received my scholarship money and I also earned a little bit here and there. So I was ready to go a little Taobao crazy. <laughs> so today I'm just going to show you guys what I purchased the last two days. I just received all the packages. Some of them I already opened and then two minutes ago I just came back with the, the, two, the last two packages. So without further ado, let's just get into this video. The first thing that I have purchased is a milk. So Danish milk factory Ala is making milk for the Chinese people as well. This is the long, is it called long term or long lasting milk? So in Denmark I'm always used to buying like super fresh milk. But because here that's quite pricey and also I don't have any supermarkets nearby like that uh, where I can buy fresh fresh milk. So I just go with these also because I don't want to go out and buy all the time so every time I just buy 10 liters of this kind of skimmed milk from Ala and then it comes immediately afterwards like I literally buy it on the app like one afternoon and then next morning is here it's so freaking fast so I just receive a box with 10 liters and then I bring them back and then I have nine under my bed now and then this one is the first one I started using what people always discuss here is is this like a real imported product or is it called imported but actually produced in China so I was just looking at the back here I never cared for this before but then because my Chinese friends they always talk about it so I thought hmm I want to know what I can see here on the package is that it says country of origin Germany so it's Ala Foods Germany who is producing this milk then I was wondering hmm it, it's all Chinese here so it would make more sense if it was actually produced here in China but I have a feeling that this kind of milk is made solely for Chinese customers so it would make sense that they're just shipping like a huge what is it called like a container of milk all the time and then they just have like one big warehouse here where they sell the milk anyways I really like this milk it's kind of skill, 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 <laughs> skimmed milk <laughs> It tastes fine and it lasts for a while which is really nice so yeah I just need my milk and I really like this one so if you're ever in China and you need a good skimmed milk then let me know and I'll send you the link to uh, this Ala one from Germany <laughs> I think this one is imported but anyways if you have any other experience just let me know in the comments below I really don't know I'm just guessing the second thing I purchased is a pair of sunglasses because the Sun seems to keep staying around here even though we are like just about to hit oh it's already the first of october today okay yeah so we're already in october but it's so freaking warm outside so i was like i want a pair of glasses mm. what do you guys think i think they're cute cute so these were like i don't know 35 rmb i think really nice quality usually i pay less but then the quality is also worse so it's nice to have a pair that's actually a little nicer also want to say that the milk was 10 liters for 100 RMB, which is like 10 RMB a liter. I think that is pretty nice. The third thing that I purchased is another, I, I think it's imported. I'm not sure. The thing is just that lately I've been trying to be more healthy and I want to eat more tuna. So I purchased tuna because the tuna here in the shops are is really expensive. I think it's just not that common to eat, I guess. So this one is all written in Chinese. I think this one is okay. This one is from Shandong province, so this is not imported. But I'm fine with that. You know, if it's good, I'll try it, and then if it's good, I'll just keep purchasing it. Like for me, I'm like, if I'm happy with the product, I just keep buying it because I eat very simple food. Same thing every day. So if something is good, then I'll just keep going with this. Also the packaging is really nice, I think. It looks very nice. So I'm excited to try this one out too. Number four on this purchase list are these beauties. Hello, yes. 
So lately, when the VPN is not really working, it's usually because the Wi-Fi connection here is quite slow and bad. Like today, it doesn't work at all, no Wi-Fi. So when that happens, that the Wi-Fi is really slow, actually working, but like really slow, then I don't want to force the VPN on because then it's just way too slow. So what I do is I just go on Taobao and then I just use it as a little, you know, waste my time kind of thing instead of doing instead of watching YouTube and stuff so what I usually look for is foreign brands but I don't want to pay like overpriced here because a lot of foreign brands they know the Chinese they love international brands so they put up the prices on purpose which is really annoying but what I do then is I try on Taobao I try to find the factories that's producing stuff products for these big international companies. So I found this little shop on Taobao that is selling foreign products or for foreign clothes and foreign shoes. I really like that because it's in my sizes so it's much easier for me to manage and I also like to sell much more than the Chinese. I'm sorry but let's be honest here I don't like Chinese fashion style. So when I found these shoes I was like oh my god these are great I want these I want these and because they're produced for foreign brand I also know the sizes of the shoes so it's very easy to buy they're just so beautiful and when they arrived this is really funny when they arrived they were in the box in the box they were in a box and obviously on the box it said boohoo.com so this shop that I bought from they're obviously buying products from the factory that is producing clothes for Boohoo. And if you guys don't know Boohoo, that's totally fair if you're a guy, obviously, <laughs> you don't know. But Boohoo is this huge uh, online store website where you can buy all these amazing, beautiful pieces of clothing and shoes. And it's like literally my favorite shop online. So when I saw the box, I was like, oh my god, obviously I love these shoes because they're from Boohoo, literally. I just bought it from the factory, not from the store. Am I like confusing you now? I hope not. <laughs> Anyways, I was just really excited. I looked into the shoes and it says Boohoo inside as well. So that's just really cool. I've tried this before where I would receive clothes. I bought it from a Taobao shop, but it said Forever 21. It said Sarah. A lot of my clothes is Sarah, even though I buy it for like a much lower price than the actual shop. So yeah, that's just a life here in China, I guess. I okay, number five on this list. Now we have to open a package because I have two packages left and I haven't opened any of them yet. So let's get into it. Number five looks like this. I have a feeling I know what it is, but let's see. Hey, the thing for me is that when I watch YouTube, I see what other girls they buy in America and I'm like, oh my god, I want that too. And then I look on Taobao to see if I can find, you know, the factories that's producing. Literally, Taobao has everything. So, ah, oh my god, I got a lot of extra stuff here. So, I've seen girls having these, like, rainbow or, like, unicorn brushes. And I was like, what? I need them too. So yeah, I found them. Oh, they're so cool. What the heck, man? Oh my god, and so soft. Yeah, so I got a bunch of rainbow unicorn uh, brushes. Also a little bag, and usually you always get all these like funny extra things with it. So they gave me like a bunch of cheap brushes. I guess I could use those too. If you're good, then why not? <laughs> These were like extra just like falling out in my, uh, falling out on me when I opened it. Oh, and then little one, me. No, but that's so cute. Oh my God, these are so cute. And they're like all these different sizes and it was like, I don't know, 35 quite I think, I guess. But yeah, just having them here. Oh, I can put them in this one. I have this really cool thing. Then you can just see the top. Ah, so cool. <laughs> I know. There we go. Number six I'm also really excited about because I was watching a YouTube video from a girl who was trying to buy some good copies of like big branded shoes and when I saw the shoes I was like, 
ooh, I want to see if I can find some too, like even cheaper than what she did. Again, it's more of a competition for me than actually because I like the, the stuff. I don't know, it's, it's a bad habit, but yeah, I just, I was really curious, like, oh my God, I want to see if I can find them. So I actually found them and now we'll see if the quality is good or not, how they look like. So let's get into it. So what I'm talking about is the Puma Fenty or like Rihanna collaboration. It says Puma and Fenty on this box. On the side here it says both sneaker women's pink tint, pink tint, pink tint. And the sizes and made in Vietnam. Hmm, interesting. Oh, we'll see what we got here. What? Oh my god, they're so cute. Look at these gals. Look at these gals. Oh my god, so cute. Yes. Made in Vietnam. How the heck did I get these shoes for that price? Oh my goodness grace. I, guys, I paid 65 RMB, I think, for these shoes. Like, what the heck? Oh my goodness grace. So, I don't know, I saw the real ones and I feel like they look quite alike. I don't know if they're like good, actual good shoes, but we'll see. There's a little black mistake here on the back, but that's it. I think that's okay. So cute, I'm excited to use them. So that was all for this little Taobao haul. I hope you liked it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe for more videos from Lingley below. Check out my Patreon uh, 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 or my social media Facebook, Lingley Around, Instagram, Lingley Around. And I hope you're having a great day, evening, wherever you are. And what? I'll see you again very, very soon. Lingley's out. See ya and bye bye.